a sewage tanker discharging human waste into the sea. Significant amount of waste are generated in Ghana, but proper waste management has been a challenge. Nations today are caught between a rising population generating huge amount of waste and the rapid depletion of non-renewable energy sources. Likely, attention now is shifting towards the use of technology to recycle the volume of waste generated daily. Biogas technology, which converts biological waste into energy, is considered by experts to be the best tool for improving lives. Because it is airtight, right? The gas will now develop in there. And then you can channel the gas through a pipe network for sustainable use, like cooking, electricity generation, refrigeration, and so on. So in other words, I now don't see it as waste. I see it now more as a raw material which can be sustainably used. According to the World Watch Institute, about 60 million households use small-scale biodigesters worldwide. Ghana passed the Renewable Energy Act in 2011 to provide guidelines on how to effectively recycle waste to meet the country's energy needs. Since then, biogas technology has been installed in some homes and institutions. The Chief Executive Officer of Biogas Technology Africa, Dr. John Aydan, says the continent has been using this technology for some time now. I'm at Mr. John Aydan's house. This compound looks very normal, but beneath is a biogas plant where all the chemical processes take place. The sewage from the office and from the home all ends up here. At the end of the day, gas is generated and what is left is then brought to this filtration plant. And he's here to tell us more about what exactly happens here. In the filtration bed, I have what I call the hydrated carbon. Okay. The, what it does is that should there be any fecal coliforms, they will die here aerobically. I have this submersive pump, okay. which will lift it into my flower gardens. So the gas that is developed in the digester is neatly piped underneath this, and then it ends up through this line, and then comes here. So when I open here, and I scratch the matches, I've got my gas. A well-maintained biodigester can last over 20 years. The technology has the benefit of improving sanitation, reducing greenhouse gas emissions, and reduces the demand for wood and charcoal for cooking, which helps to preserve natural vegetation. The Ghana Energy Commission has been promoting the use of this technology in the country. The Energy Commission is um, under its Energy Research and Development Program, is supporting Safisana Foundation Ghana to generate um, gas or to generate electricity from bio from biogas now the 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 project has established a toilet facility for the community where um, people come in to use the facility um, at any time and then the waste that is generated is used to generate um, biogas and then this biogas is then used to generate electricity. Experts believe the adoption of biogas technology will help meet Ghana's energy needs and solve the waste management problems in our cities. Thomas Nadi Batuma, Barsatwa News.